Every year, I always tell myself in my head, because I don't talk to myself out loud, that this year I'm gonna get ready for Halloween early, i.e. be prepared for Halloween, i.e. I won't just put together a last minute costume because I spent the entire month of October thinking that Halloween is at the end of the month and that I still have time to put together an amazing outfit that will be unique and cute and pretty and not too slutty and not too basic, but basic enough and you get the point. There's a high chance that someone out there is exactly like me. In other words, you and I are the same. We have different faces, but inside we are same, same. Same, same, but different, but still same. And we need last minute costume inspo for Halloween because let's be honest, we're not gonna end up buying anything for Halloween this year, right? So here are my Halloween costume outfit ideas for Halloween using only a cami dress and other miscellaneous accessories. The first outfit is inspired by Tinkerbell. It's a pretty simple outfit. Essentially, all you're gonna need is a green dress, preferably not like forest green, but like this one. You're gonna need some fairy wings. I got mine from Amazon, just like every other item in my house nowadays because I'm a lazy ass who can't seem to get out of the house for mundane chores and errands anymore. I finished this outfit with some clear heels because I didn't have any green shoes and I want to be realistic with this, you know? I don't want to buy green shoes. I also added these elf ears to make my costume more realistic or whatever. And this is my Tinkerbell outfit. Super slay. Now a really easy costume using the same green dress is Princess Tiana from The Princess and the Frog, which is one of my favorite Disney movies of all time. I just swap out the wings for some white gloves and a tiara. Super easy, super simple. I love this because I've tried on this outfit for some of my friends to test the recognizability of this outfit and they were able to tell like, yeah, that's Tiana. So it works, okay. Now I'm switching out the green cami dress for a light purple lilac kind of dress. This was kind of random. I couldn't think of an outfit using purple other than Rapunzel from Tangled, but I don't look anything like her, so this purple dress could be used for any like elf or fairy type costume. You could totally wear a t-shirt and jeans with wings and people will be like, oh, you're a fairy or an elf thing. So I'm pretty sure this is a solid costume. The purple makes it look all ethereal and fairy-esque. So I'm standing my ground. This is a good no cost costume, okay? Next, I have this bright hot pink cami dress. I'm dressing it up with some chunky platforms for some sassy attitude, a bedazzled clutch purse thing for some super extra extraness, and some white shades. Can you guess who I am? Yes, exactly. I'm Elle Woods from Legally Blonde. Yeah, wow, I'm so good at dressing up. Wow, I'm just so good at this costume thing. Yes, I know I'm not blonde. I'm Elle Woods from Legally Brunette, all right? I'm gonna stand strong with my costume. Elle Woods would totally stand strong with this costume, and so I believe this is an Elle Woods costume, all right? Switching out the hot pink for the baby blue, can you guess this next costume? She wears gloves, a tiara and runs around in just one glass slipper, just like every drunk girl on Friday night. Exactly, it's Cinderella. Again, I'm not blonde, but you're creative and I believe in your ability to imagine me as a blonde. I love this outfit so much that I may or may not be Cinderella this Halloween, depending on the weather. I'm a cold hoe and yes, I can somehow manage to get cold in LA in October, so it really depends. I love this costume though, and I believe you will too, under the right circumstances. And finally, the little black dress. Honestly, this costume has been around since the dawn of humanity. People were dressing up in black, pretending to be sexy cats or sexy bunnies or other sexy animals that have whiskers and noses. So I just threw this costume in here because it involves a cami dress and that's like the whole title and the point of this video. Honestly, there's nothing wrong with this costume. There's a reason it's been around for so long. It's easy, it's cute, and everyone knows exactly what you are. You might have to guess between the cat or the bunny first, but in this case, my bunny ears definitely give that away. 
I'm obviously not a cat. Um, my ears are also falling off too often, which is probably a good indicator that this is the end of the video. I hope you found some good inspo for outfits, and I wish you the hoeiest Halloween. Thanks for watching, and see you in the next one. Bye.